Hello and welcome back to my channel or if you are new here, welcome. My name is Helena and I am so glad to have you here. So a bit of a quick intro today because as you'll have seen from the title, it is my birthday weekend and I know a birthday is a day but we're making it into a weekend. So I'm in the middle of getting ready, hence why I'm in my dressing gown, um, as I'm off out for dinner and drinks with the girls tonight. So if you follow me over on Instagram, or you have seen my vlog from, I think it'll be two weeks ago now, I am going out with Chess, Rebecca, Rachel and Abby. So I am, I'll tag all their accounts um, in the description box down below so that you can go and check out their accounts on Instagram and their channels on YouTube. So I am going to go and finish getting ready. Um, and then I'm heading out in literally like half an hour. And then for the rest of the vlog, I'm going to take you along on everything that I get up to throughout my birthday weekend. So I really hope you enjoy it. So I'm in the car with Chess. She's just picked me up and we are on our way to meet the other girls. We're dead so excited. Cute. I'm excited for a girly night out. Me too. Can't wait. And we're all in pink. Pink and um, it's national wear pink today. So yeah. And all the other girls are in pink. And we're well. going to like a really cute pink bar. This yeah. wasn't even like no, fun. It wasn't. Oh! I've got a birthday present! This is the best type of birthday present. Thanks, oh my god, it matches my dress. Thanks! Right, I'm gonna... Oh, thanks girls. Jake, can you be in charge? Thanks. Jake's gonna take it back for me. Oh, so we've come here to La Fleur in Preston and it looks so pretty. Hey! Look how cute it is in here! So cute! Look at the mirror! <laughs> so boring! Oh, look at these cocktails! So pretty! So we've just come to Mowgli for some food. It's literally so pretty on the lights. So obsessed! <laughs> Cheers! So I've got, um, well, four of us have got the same. I think it's rose and lychee. And then what did you get, Becca? Ooh, nice. We're in the photo booth. We pressed wind. And it was literally like wind. Oh my God, cute. Look at our hair. <laughs> it's my birthday. So I've luckily woke up not too hungover on my birthday. Um, I've just got ready, popped on this little new um, Zara dress which I ordered. It's really sweet. I um, feel like I'll just throw this on all the time because it's dead comfy. Um, so yeah, it's cute. And then we are just heading to my mum's and me, Matt and my mum are heading out for the day. So I will take you along with me. So we have come to Holden Clough. This is gorgeous little um, the garden centre, cafe and home section. It's beautiful. We love these alliums. Thank you. Look how big these hydrangeas are. I think I might have to buy one of those. Honestly, the pots here, I mean, plant pot heaven. Look at these cute little, like, ditzy print ones. Little terracotta. That jug's really cute. Oh, I love it. Oh, that is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I love it. How perfect is that? Oh, I love it. Look at that for a picnic basket. Mum's found a cute little <laughs> handbag basket. <laughs> I absolutely love this print. It's gorgeous. It's on like a fabric. That is so cute. And it owns the sleeve. I love that. So cute. <gasps> Look at these. They've got like the little beaded edge. They are gorgeous. The small ones, 26. Oh, I love those, they look so cute together. Oh, I love this tea white holder. It's like a mini hurricane bars. It's really nice. Oh, yeah, I was just thinking I love that little scallops part. That's really cute, a little cactus in it. So cute. 
Oh, that suits you. With, with the hats as well. Let's see. Yeah, cute. <laughs> oh, that's gorgeous. Evie's saying I need decking to then have all these hung up. He's so cute. This is the cute little cafe that's here. It's called the Reading Room. Oh, look at all these pots. Literally terracotta pot heaven. I found a hydrangea tree and I feel like I need it. I've never seen a hydrangea in a tree form before. How amazing is that? just got back and I picked up a few plants from the garden centre that we went to um, so I got three of these alliums they're literally so pretty so when I was at um, Rachel's house home on Cranberry Meadows and um, you probably saw because it was in my vlog she had loads of gorgeous purple alliums and then they had them there in the garden centre today and they were on I think it was three for ten pounds which I thought was really good so I picked up three of those and then I'll show you the hydrangea I've also got and then this is the hydrangea that I got. Ooh, look how tall it is. So it's a hydrangea and a bell. This is a little tag. And oh my gosh, yeah, it's just so tall. I'm obsessed with it. So it was, I think it was 28 pounds. Uh, yeah, 28, which I thought for a hydrangea that size is really, really good. And I just love a plant with like a bit of height. Um, so I'm gonna get that in a new pot. So another little outfit as we are off out for dinner. So I've just got a little black dress on um, with this like ruffle detail. It was only really cheap from H&M and then I've just paired it with my Valentino sandals and my Louis Vuitton bag. So because it's so warm, I just wanted something dead, kind of light and breezy. So yeah, quite summery, but still kind of appropriate for like going out for dinner. So we've got crispy chilli chicken, some soft noodles and rice and we've treated ourselves to the wagyu beef. And then for dessert we've got strawberry samosas which are delicious. So we are off to the lakes for the night. Martha is coming, we're having a little family trip um, and we've got a really cute little like hut thing booked um, so I can't wait for you to see that. And gorgeous weather so i'm hoping it's nice up there it's not actually too far from us um it's only about an hour's drive so yeah we are gonna head off there now and i will make sure to fill you in on everything we get up to Martha, are we going to go in the doggy shop? What is there? Wow. <laughs> so this is where we are staying and our little cabin is just through these hedges here. So I will show you when we get to it. It's just been raining, but it has just dried up and it's more sunny now, which is good. So this is it, our cute little home for the night. And here's the front door. So cute. So I thought I would show you around our little cabin. So it's got this gorgeous door that opens like halfway 
um, like a farmhouse door. And then here is the inside. It's a dead, dead cute. And obviously I am obsessed that all of the walls are tongue and grieve. So here's the little kitchen. Aren't the windows just adorable? So cute, it's real like country vibes. Just like the prettiest views out the window. And then here is the little bed area. It's actually really comfy. We've not slept on it yet, but we just sat on it to test it out. And you've got these really cute little wall lights. It's just so adorable. I love it. And then it's just our bags. And then a window with another stunning view, like I'll show you here. It's just beautiful. And then like a little table area, um, a bit to put your shoes on and some hooks. And then over here is a little fire if you want it. And we've bought some um, logs and fire lighters because we are going to hopefully use a little fire pit tonight. So that'll be dead cute. So yeah, isn't it adorable? And then I think for a one night stay, we've paid £120 for two of us, um, which I don't think is too bad. And that's like the little toilet and shower. I won't actually show you that because I'm not going to use that because I'm just way too scared of spiders. Um, so I'm going to go and use in the house up here. They have like toilets and everything that you can use. So I'm going to go and use that. But yeah, it's just beautiful here. It's just a really nice chilled little night away for us. Um, and Martha is just loving pottering around where she can. Get it. So we are just walking to go and get some dinner, surrounded by gorgeous places. Um, it's about an hour walk. So we're gonna walk there, get some food, have a drink, and then walk back. And then hopefully it'll still be nice weather and we can sit outside with the log burner and have a glass of wine. We've just been out for breakfast this morning and now we are heading for a nice walk along a river. Martha loves to swim, um, so we thought we'd take to the river. So I am just putting my walking boots on in case it gets muddy. But it's another gorgeous day. We were really worried it was going to rain, but yeah, it's dead nice. So we are going to head off for a walk. Martha, say hello to the cow. Go on, Marth. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh my gosh, a little leg hurt my heart. It's so cute. <laughs> oh, look how beautiful this house is. I absolutely love like the stone mixed with oh, like the sage um, window frames. It's absolutely gorgeous. Hello, so we are obviously back from the lakes now, um, as you can probably tell. So we got back a few hours ago and I'm just sat wrapping Matt's birthday present. So I just thought I would come on for a chit chat whilst I do. Um, yes, obviously it was my birthday too and then it is Matt's. Um, our birthdays are three days apart. Loads of people always say to me, oh, do you not hate that like your birthdays are really close? But I quite like it. Um, but yeah, we had such a nice time in the lakes. Um, it was really lovely where we stayed. We didn't like, we didn't go with like a plan of doing anything in particular or like a really busy schedule. Sorry, I can't get in the facilitator. Let me just focus. But yeah, it was so nice to just almost just like have a change of scenery. And it was dead nice to be able to take Martha away as well. It's just been a really busy weekend with it having been my birthday as well. Um, and then the plans for Matt's birthday tomorrow, I said to him, oh, what do you want to do? Um, and of course, his answer was play golf. So tomorrow I am designated buggy driver at the golf course. How exciting. <laughs> and then we're going to go out for some food, which will be really nice. Um, 
And then what else are we doing? Oh, and then I, I'm gonna do actually after this, I'm gonna film a little haul of like what I got for my birthday because of course a lot of it was home decor related. Um, so I'm gonna show you all the bits that I got and I actually got a couple of Neptune vouchers. So I said I wanted to go and spend those and Matt suggested that we could go there tomorrow after we played golf. And I was like, are you sure you wanna go to Neptune on your birthday? But he was quite happy to. So obviously I'm not gonna say no to that. Um, so I think we are gonna go to Neptune as well. So I'm sure there will be a couple of bits for me to show you from there as well. I knew there was something else to tell you about as well. Um, I've had a few people ask me what has happened post my last vlog where we had the um, burst water pipe. And it's all okay now. So luckily a plumber came out the next day um, and he fixed it really quickly. Um, but it does now mean that we've got a huge hole in the wall. Um, and we're just waiting for a plaster to come out to fix that. So I think the plaster is coming out on Friday. So I've only got four days to wait. Um, but do you know what is so typical? The shelves that we were trying to put up, bits that I'd asked for for my birthday that are like home decor related um, were actually things to go on the shelves. So yeah, obviously styling those on my shelves is gonna have to wait, um, but I'm hoping Maybe in the next vlog, by then it will all be done and I'll be able to show you what it looks like finished off. I'm not sure how it's actually going to work because obviously we now know there's a pipe there and that's kind of where the, the holes need to be. So I have no idea how it's going to work, um, but we'll just have to wait and see. Um, but yeah, as I said, hopefully by Friday, well after Friday, the hole will be filled in and then that will be the end of the burst pipe disaster. <laughs> So this is the fabric I've just got our dining chairs in. And they've got the Francesca grand print in this table runner. And doesn't it look gorgeous? We have brought Martha today. <laughs> share the bits that I got for my birthday and the bits that I picked up just when I popped to Neptune for a little shop. So I'm going to show you those now. And I've also just made myself a coffee out of my new coffee machine and oh my god it tastes amazing. So I actually got the coffee machine off Facebook Marketplace just because I love a bargain. It's the Sage Nespresso one um, and I paid £100 for it and it should be like 300 brand new and like it was all wrapped. It had just been for a service so like it's such a bargain and the coffee it's made is just like incredible. Um, I wanted a machine with a froth on for ages you know so you can get a really nice like frothy milky coffee um and it's so good so if you see me sipping away throughout that is why i am making the most of it so i'm so excited for this haul because i feel like it's even more special because it's my birthday all these bits are from like my favorite people and so it just makes it like even nicer so um i'll show you a couple of bits that my mum got me so my mum got me some bits from neptune First up is this gorgeous marble serving board. Honestly, it's beautiful. I have eyed this up in Neptune for ages and oh, it's so, so stunning. So this is called, let me just check. 
It's the Maltby Rectangular Serving Board in marble. And yeah, it's just beautiful. I'm obsessed with it. I will pop the links and the names of everything down in the description box below for you. And then the other piece that my mum got me is something else I've obviously been looking at for ages is this gorgeous pot. Now this is called the Time Small Pot in stone and it's gorgeous. It's got so much nice like detail and texture to it and the colours are just perfect aren't they? Gorgeous earthy um, muted tones. So I need to get something nice to go in that. I'm going to have a look at some of my favourite um, small business websites and see if I can get a nice plant to pop in it. So yeah, love that. And then my sister, so she works for a gorgeous, gorgeous business, home decor business called Silver Mushroom. If you haven't heard of them before, you need to go and look at their website. They've got so many stunning things and she got me this gorgeous... Again, another sort of serving tray um, she got from Silver Mushroom. So I don't know what, if there's a specific name for it. Um, I'll get the link and pop it down in the description box, but it's beautiful. I think it's called like a shovel tray because obviously you can see it's like really deep. And I think Chess has got this in her laundry room. And when I was at hers once, I was like, oh my God, I love that. And then my sister has got it for me. So yeah, super, super cute. And just a little bit different being so like deep. So I love that. And then the other thing my sister got me is the Neptune bird. So I've actually got one of these already in case you're like an Instagram follower and you've seen it. I have got one of these styled on my bedside table, but the one that I've got upstairs is the small one. Um, so this is called the Jefferson Large Bird. And it's actually, it's the same materials and tones as the pot so you can see they match just like perfectly um and i just love this as a styling piece so i'm forever like moving it around so i just thought i need another of those so when people are asking me what i wanted i just sent a big long list and they chose them for me and i just love it so yeah that's super cute and it will be if you've seen my last vlog, you know we've got to say this very carefully. It might be going on my kitchen shelves if we ever get them up. I will show you a little update on what's going on with them after this little haul. So yeah, love those. So the girls that I went out with, you'll have seen at the start of the video, um, gave me a Neptune bag when we first arrived. And this is what is inside. So they got me the Neptune Francesca apron. So when we went to um, Neptune in Nutsford, I was really eyeing this up because I knew that I was ordering this fabric for my dining chairs, which you'll have seen in my last vlog. And they've got me the matching apron, so this is going to be so cute to style and also wear um, in my kitchen. I absolutely love it. Me and my dining chairs are just going to blend into one. Um, so yeah, gorgeous little kick. And then they got me these two Neptune, these are the Lulworth mini bowls in grey. They've got um, like a top version in this range. They've got the full dining set and it's just beautiful. I was looking at it when I was in there Um at the weekend and yeah these are just so cute you can use them as like little dipping bowls um you know for like serving things or i think becca might have bought one or maybe chess one of the girls anyway um bought some to pop on like your bedside table you know so like when you take your jewelry off at night you can just pop your earrings your rings in there um just as a pretty little dish and yeah it's just so cute or like the curved edge it's beautiful so yeah the girls treated me i'm so lucky they're beautiful so what Matt got me, he took a ticket to Red Hot Chili Peppers, which we're going to go to in a couple of weeks. And then he got me a few bits from two of my favourite brands. He's such a good present buyer. Um, so he got me something from Joe Malone. And if you have not smelled the Myrrh and Tonka scent before, then, oh my gosh, you are missing out. It's literally like my scent. I just love it. If I'm ever going out... I just reach for that because it's just beautiful. So he got me this little set that's got the shower oil in. I've never had the shower oil before and it's honestly gorgeous. Like I've got the, I've got a big body cream and this comes with a little body cream, which is perfect for traveling. But honestly, if you use this in the shower, then you use the body cream, which by the way, is just so soft and like velvety and creamy. It's beautiful. And then you put the perfume on, which it came with a little mini then you just smell divine. So, oh, honestly, I love it. It's just beautiful. So yeah, if you're after a new scent, definitely go and have a look at that because it's stunning. And then he got me a few little bits from the White Company. 
in my favourite scent, which is Seychelles. So I've got the lip balm, which is gorgeous, by the way. Um, he then got me a little bar of soap. He honestly knows me so well. When I was opening it, he was like, oh, it's just something small, but I thought you'd really like to style it in the bathroom. And then when I opened it, I was like, oh my gosh, yes, that is so true. So this is a bar of soap and it says the white company on it there in the middle. And oh, honestly, the smell of it is divine. It is just literally like a holiday scent just bottled up the Seychelles scent. It's just incredible. I love it. It's so fresh. Um, it's just beautiful. And then he got me the candle. I've not lit this yet. I might light this tonight. I'm having a little chilled night in with Martha. Matt has actually gone out. Um, so I was just going to get a takeaway, put a girly film on, and I might have to light my candle. So this is the Seychelles candle. It's beautiful. I think if you're ever like looking for a gift for somebody, just getting them like a white company candle or just something from their range is just like you can't go wrong um it's just all beautiful it's like it's dead neutral like the decor it would just match anyone's taste smells insane and yeah the quality is just gorgeous so they were the bits that matt got me so i'm just gonna have a sip of my coffee i've seen that i went shopping at neptune the southport one which is my local store it's about a 20 minute drive away um so I had a couple of vouchers, um, Matt's mum got me one and my friends also got me one. So obviously I could not keep hold of them for long and I had to go and spend them. Um, so these are the bits that I picked up. So I've not even unwrapped them yet, so I'm going to have to unwrap them. So this first piece is part of the Ashcroft range. Now, when I went to Nutsford, um, Becca actually picked this up and we were like amazed at what good value it is for Neptune and for the Ashcroft range because the Ashcroft range is quite expensive. So on my dining table, sorry, I'm pointing like you can see, <laughs> on my dining table, um, which if you watched my last vlog, you would have seen me style it. I've got the Ashcroft breakfast tray on there, which is gorgeous. And this is actually a bread basket, believe it or not. Um, but it's really long and it's quite deep. So I am hoping to do a bit of an update to my dressing room. So what I thought this would be perfect. Oh, I could actually show you my Jo Malone bits. I thought in my dressing room, imagine like perfumes or bits like that, you know, just popped in here. It's just beautiful. So I really like that. You can use that in so many different places. You could use it in your kitchen. You could pop it on a shelf. Um, I think Becca bought it for in her bathroom, which I love. Um, and then, yeah, I think I'm going to use it for like my day-to-day -day, like perfumes, um, you know, like moisturizers, things like that. It's just a really nice way of displaying them. And that was 30 pounds. So yeah, for Neptune, that is quite good. And it's a long basket. It's 40 centimeters long. So, so happy with that. They only had a couple in there. So I just grabbed that whilst I could. And then another big thing, this is to go with one of the pieces which I showed you at the start. So, gorgeous chopping board I honestly Neptune's chopping boards I know it's just a chopping board but like their woods and the tones of their woods are just beautiful um so I just could not resist again this is another piece that I've been eyeing up for ages so this is the Burra rectangular oak chopping board in seasoned oak so it matches the oak of my dining table which is just, oh, it's just beautiful. So my plan is to style this with the marble one, which my mum got me. So let me show you what that looks like together. These are quite heavy, so I need to be careful. This weighs an absolute ton, by the way. So I'm gonna style them together on my um, kitchen sides. And don't they just look gorgeous together? I think like the warm tones of the wood just complements the marble so so well they look gorgeous together um, and they do have these I think this one comes in a round one as well and they've got a larger one so there's so many different sizes so that you can match it to your space but yeah I love those I think they look gorgeous together I can't wait to get them styled properly because obviously I've not even I hadn't even unwrapped this so I'm dead excited to see how that looks and then the last bits that I got these are quite new in Neptune, actually, um, like within the past couple of months. And they're all part of a set. So it is the Loose range. And this is the large jar. So it's really tall. 
See there, you can store things in it. So I've got these again from my kitchen. Can you tell that I'm trying to give my kitchen a little revamp? Oh so, yes, this is the tall one and it's in a gorgeous, it's like a, it's not white. It's like a really light gray, but not a kind of a harsh gray. Um, and I just love like the ribbed ceramic. And then I got two others to go with it. So they have three sizes, so I got all three. So this one is the medium. And again, in the same style. Ooh. See that? Not too sure what I'm gonna pop in it yet. They would be really nice for like tea, coffee, sugar. Um, I was thinking I might pop the new um, Nespresso pods that I got for my machine in there. But I'm gonna see. Again, could be a contender for the new shelves when we get there. Can't get too giddy. Uh, let me unwrap this one. Sorry, this one is so well wrapped. <laughs> this is the smallest one and this is just called the small ceramic jar. So yeah, you can see they all match really, really nicely. I'll try and hold all three together. Ooh, I'm struggling here, I'm nervous. So that's all three of them. So they look so nice styled together with like all staggered with the different heights. Um, so yeah, I'm dead happy with those. So that is everything. I feel so lucky to have been bought so many gorgeous things from all my lovely family and friends. I'm so, so happy with them. And of course it was all home decor related because it's me and I am just totally home decor mad. So a quick little snippet of the wall where we drove through the pipe it has now been plastered and we are just waiting for it to dry so we are nearly there and hopefully we should be able to get the shelves up soon so fingers crossed I really hope you enjoyed that and liked all the pieces that I got. And as I said earlier, I will pop links to them down below. Um, so that is the end of the vlog. I really hope you enjoyed it. Obviously, it was a little bit different because there was loads of different things going on. But I just thought it'd be really nice to take you along on my birthday weekend and just see what I get up to outside of just styling my house, etc. Um, so thank you so much for watching. Um, please do like and leave a comment down below if you enjoyed it. And remember to subscribe so that you don't miss my next next video coming out. So yeah, thank you again and I cannot wait to catch up with you all soon.